everyone! Welcome back to our channel. I'm Cindy, Mrs. B. I'm Mado, Mr. B. And you're watching Mr. and Mrs. B of Moss, Moss Design, Design House. House. Woo! Today's episode is going to be a fun episode because it will be a celebrity interior design style challenge. Yeah. So we have the Moss machine na operate ni Mr. Beltran. And the machine will randomly pick the celebrity and the room mm -hmm. and then we're going to brainstorm and figure out what is the best theme that is suited for that particular celebrity. Diba? So it's gonna be fun, brainstorming sesh. Talk, Based sa right? pagkakilala natin sa tao na yan. Oo, oh, oh, parang close mo, no? Kung, parang kung sabihin mong pagkakakilala. Close to Yeah, based on like how we know of this person. Okay, game. First one. Okay, game na. Kaching. Harry Styles. Bedroom. Oh, Harry Styles. Kaya mo siya? Sa intro pa niya nun. Bella. Kasi <laughs> Bianca. Alam ko lang kasi ni Bella. Kasi actually din ko nga lang siya na kilala. <laughs> Hindi kasi siguro ako bagets. Alam ko One Direction singer siya. Medyo eclectic siya. Very eclectic. Parang, I, okay, I know of him because of his Vogue cover. I will base it from that, ah, kasi hindi kami masyadong close ni Faring Harry. Um, I guess he's very eclectic, kind of like very old soul. Feeling ko, very mid-century yeah, mod. Like yeah. Mid-century mod. Ano ba to? So, it's a 50s and 60s um, look wherein there's a lot of use of bent plastic, a lot of use of wood. Ito yung mga famous chairs ni Charles, Ray and Charles Ames. It feels very retro. retro, kind of. Pero it's more on the wooden side, right? So, in terms of interiors, you'd see a lot of panelings. Mm -hmm. Colors nito, very famous. More of the yellows, tans, mustard, mustard oranges, rust, yung very moss green yan. That's the look of, ano, of mid-century. Yung bedroom niya, I feel, would be more on the you know, walls would be on the neutral side. Mm -hmm. Perhaps one wall would be wood paneled. Ano pa? I inisip ko yung bed for post eh. Wedding four post bed, no? Na parang a little bit modern. Bed modern, yeah. He will probably have a lounge kasi in mid-century, it's also very common na parang bigla na lang may lounge dito. In very seating that are found on corners, he'll probably have a nice lounge there that's leather. Animal skin rug. Animal skin rug. Maybe a little bit of a lush material. Siguro he'd probably like to have a deep green, you know, maybe a, a chase. <laughs> I feel like he's gonna have vinyl record. That's also very mid-century. Yes. You know, a nice sideboard, a, a mid-century sideboard that will have a turntable. Color scheme niya would be, ako, I'd imagine talaga a lot of like rust. Wood finish. Rust, wood finish, a pop of mustard and olives. Yeah. Ito yung lighting niya medyo warm. Dim, dim na. Dim na? Warm. Uh, okay, next. Moss machine. Kaching! <laughs> Okay, Elon Musk and Man Cave. Okay, for those of you who don't know Elon Musk, he is, uh, I think, one of the world's richest man now. already now. Yeah. Um, he owns Tesla, he used to own PayPal, it was sold, and SpaceX. Am and I correct? And Barkada siya ni Mado. Mr. B. <laughs> so, feeling ko, ito, talagang ito si Human Iron Man. Feeling, Tony feeling Stark. ko talaga siya si Tony, 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 Tony yeah. Stark. So, I think without a doubt, that's futuristic. Mga siguro futuristic minimalist. What is futuristic minimalist? You know, this is kind of, like a feel of this is very streamlined. You can see curves, but they're very clean. Almost like very space age, pero hindi. Parang let's, you know, it's medyo earthy. And then I think you can choose some material. Steel, metal, aluminum. silver, aluminum. You can see copper, you can see gold, you can see concrete. I like automatically in my head it's very grayish, you know, feels 
very spacious. I mean, hello, hello, it's Elon Musk, siya, no? Minimalist, you know, this is a design style that emerged in the 19, mga 1930s. It's a Bauhaus movement, so it's characterized by very simple, simple lines, you know, materials on its simplest form, very uncluttered. You'd see there's not a lot of unnecessary pieces. Basically, it serves the, 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 the pieces that you see on the floor is what is necessary for the space. So it has its own purpose. So they don't put things that don't serve anything. In his space, okay, living room space, what we imagine would be probably very spacious. I could imagine that his flooring walls are all of the same material. Diba? Isa lang yung material niya. Hindi siya, he's not ma fru fru kind of guy. Ako naman inisip ko, like for the side table or coffee table niya, is yung makapal na sheet na bakal, nakabend lang na ganun. Stainless. Very, or stainless. Very well linis. Ako, ako, sobrang linis lang. The furniture is very well spaced out. Diba? Parang, the sofa is here, tapos yung center table parang medyo malayo. Ganun. Yeah, tapos parang, Walang TV, feeling ko, feeling ko wala siyang TV, projector lang, or something high, something high tech Palagay that he probably hasn't released. Palagay mo ba may fireplace pa siya Oo. Oh, oh. uh, yung modern na parang glass lang, tapos ano. Oo, oh, oh, I think may fireplace siya. Next! Next, so mask machine. Kaching! Hi, wait. Black, Black pink. pink. Oh my God, oh. my daughter's favorite. Black pink and the room is lounge. Lounge. Does that mean living room ulit? No. Ito! Ingat ka, mga anak mo. Hindi, no. Like, Anya would probably kill me for it. But it's pop eclectic. What do you think? You're very Korean. Very pop. Ganon. Like, I would imagine eclectic in a way that's young. Hindi yung eclectic na mix of French, mix of Rococo, mix of Baroque. Hindi ganon. There's a Yayoi Kusama chair here that's polka dotted pink and black. And then, or maybe you have a, a Jeff Koons art here. Tapos, that's complemented with a really soft vintage uh, sofa. Yung, yung mga ganon, I feel like that's how creative they are. I'm not sure if they have a big poster of them. <laughs> Maybe not, no? The neon signs. I think that's also one of the characteristics of pop eclectic. It's colorful, there's print, there's patterns. In this entertainment area or this lounge area, I feel like this is where they're going to welcome their guests into their house. So I would imagine a nice, you know, a gallery wall here of them. I would imagine in the sides of the space, it may be a shelving that has all their maybe awards and vintage stuff, mga maybe from the fans, I'm guessing. I'm also thinking of an oversized drop light chandelier kind of like it's very imposing and um, it's a wow or a piece de resistance in their space and what else my pink feeling mo my pink feeling ko meron ko meron dapat meron next one so game. moss machine kaching it's ariana grande ariana and dining area okay she's a bit is she flamboyant? Like she's, diba? But she has a lot of personality, but she's kind of like feminine too. Okay, I will match her with an art deco modern. What is art deco? It is basically a period style that emerged in the 1920s and in the Philippines it stretched mga until 1950s. The style that was prior to this was actually art nouveau. And that design theme was all like curves it was all of the mga very ornate ones I mean, curly cues ganyan yan yon so after that period in 1910 naging contrast na it was kind of like the answer to the art nouveau period so naging art deco straight lines very gatsby so if there is one movie that's so perfect for it it's the great gatsby so, but this time, you want to make it a bit more modern and glam. So, hindi natin siya gagawing very hardcore. A lot of the buildings in New York are very Art Deco, Empire State Building. Chrysler Building is very Art Deco as well. And the Rockefeller, the Rockefeller Center is very Art Deco. So, yun, characterized by gold, black, marble, um, a lot of stone. It looks very rich and, you know, very like, ma-feathery, ganyan. So, ma-fru-fru. Ma 
that's Art Deco. Now, modern twist to that and adding that glam factor is injecting a lot of the modern elements naman, and pop of color. So, okay, what do I imagine her space to be? Ikaw? Dining room siya, di ba? Oo. Drop light niya. Gold. Oh, so gold drop gold light. Black. A very big dining area with a nice marble. Hindi, actually, hindi marble. Siguro like a terrazzo kind of table na iba-ibang print. Of iba ni stone. I would think she'll probably have chairs that are very luxurious in material. Maybe a pop of color. I could imagine patterns. I think Art Deco was a play of patterns. Or maybe grills. And grills, maybe like a screen yeah. that's nice or like a laser cut material that's maybe gold, maybe? Uh, gold and black. Gold and black. Um, flooring that's patterned. Yan. Either it's herringbone, or maybe a chevron kind of print for the floor, and then on top of it would be a nice, a nice plush area rug. Tapos dining table. Let's talk about color palette. Feeling ko it's gonna be white, black, gold definitely will be there. A little bit of fuchsia, and basta something that would pop. Okay, next. Moss machine. Kaching. Rupaul. Okay. And. Masters toilet and bath. Feeling ko because RuPaul is very extravagant um, and very glam and into the, all this Hollywood thing. I think Hollywood Regency. It's a theme that emerged in the 19, mid 1900s. Very Hollywood, like how we picture Hollywood to look like in the 1950s, mm -hmm. right? Only that it's a bit more modern. That was very rich textures, like very velvet. Sometimes they're even like brocade and damask pa nga in this type of um, theme. They use fairly, like very, sometimes rococo furniture, yeah. but on silhouette, modern silhouettes. Basta mayaman yung dating nito. Okay. So, master is ano? Toilet. Uh, toilet. Anong, anong na-imagine mo? Ako, standalone yung bathtub. Yes, it's like a furniture piece. So, na merong claw and ball. Na color gold. Yeah. That was all hardware or brass vintage. Um, I could imagine a flooring that is black and white, maybe a checkered pattern. Yeah. Walls are also, you know, made out of marble. He'll probably have a furniture piece there that's a wild card that will be of, you know, nice material. Ko yung mirror niya is meron carved. Carving, yeah. It can be black or it can be gold. Yeah. Double sink. Maybe a double um, water closet too. Yeah. Because he also has a different shape. So I feel like it's gonna be super posh and super like very glam and elegant. Mm. Okay, next! Next, Mosh Machine! cha -ching. Okay, Megan, Marco. Megan, saka si Eno. And Prince Har Harry. Prince well, Harry. Hindi na, siya, hindi na siya Prince, no? Harry na lang. So, Meghan and Harry. Hindi siya pwede maging Harry. Kasi Prince siya dati. My God, <laughs> Lord. <laughs> so, baka tito talaga ng jokes nitong si Mado. Okay, and what we're designing, what room? Living room space. Okay. Yeah. Okay, feel ko is modern countryside. Like okay. living in the Hamptons. Very country feels, right? So what is that? So a lot of barn doors. A barn doors that are modern, done in a modern way. Yeah. A lot, you'll see a lot of elements of nature inside the house, but also in a modern way. Even the furniture pieces, they are very country. I see black lacquered flooring. Metal um, hardwares. Metal hardwares. Very restoration hardware. Like pero medyo sliding like, door. Kind of modern, diba? But a very, you know, countryside, Hamptons, and yeah, a lot of greens inside. Okay, how do we imagine their living room again? Ako black lacquered floor, na wood, white walls, maybe, maybe some with molding, some with not, without moldings. Very bespoke pieces. I think they they are someone who will definitely invest on bespoke furniture. Ako may isip ko ano eh, yung yung coffee table niya stressed. Table. Distress. Distress wood. Uh oh. Ako, very. Some Georgian furniture. Symmetry again, I think, is going to be like. I, mean, I could imagine a sofa that is just right across each other, same size. And then two occasional chairs on left and right. I mean, yeah. Very. Um, Yung lamp may intricate. Talaga. 
diba? Maybe. Oh, sige, pa, sige, pwede. The drop light would probably be more made out of wrought iron. Yes, and then with iron. little shades, diba? It's gonna be done in front of a fireplace. Deckers will be very large vases. And throw pillows, diba? Throw pillows that are of different sizes, well, well um, put together. I think roller shades. Roller shades combined with uh, curtains, curtain, floor yeah, to ceiling yeah. curtains, mm. diba? But, yep, color palette, neutrals. I think there's someone who likes to stick with neutrals, black, white, beiges, creams, and green, because that's just where you put the, you know, the, the light. Yeah. Okay, next, 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 go, go, go. Okay, moss machine, kaching. Ay, local! Okay, okay. Oh, yeah, kaya lang okay. kailangan yan. Okay, yeah. Ivana Alawi. Ivana. And the des- What Bed- are we designing? Bedroom. bedroom. Feeling ko bagay sa kanya talaga is the hotel feel that's transitional. This interior design style is basically if modern and traditional design got married, ito siya. Trans- transitional. So, it's the silhouettes of modern pero may mga traditional elements and design silhouettes that you see. And mostly you see that in furniture, mostly you see that in like, kunyari, there's a traditional style of furniture but the legs are modern kasi tapered na siya, you know, things like that. Um, Very typical in how a hotel looks, pero for her, feeling ko will make it more feminine. Kasi sometimes the hotel looks very sometimes very parang it lacks personality. So, ito, because she's Ivana and I feel like she's very feminine and very playful, will inject her personality. Yeah. Floor plan, I'd see a four-post bed. Tama ka? Mm-hmm. What kind? Maybe tapered? Or tapered, maybe brass? Tapered. Uh, tapered. Tapos, um, yung vanity table. Would be very, you know, very... I think the vanity table will take center stage. Has to be very nice. Um, padded wall. I would think padded wall or a padded headboard in a color that she'll love. In a very feminine color. Wallpapered all around. Maybe a little bit of moldings too because that's part of transitional. Chase lounge. Um, a chase lounge would be good. Yeah. You know, instead of a lazy boy or a one-seater. I feel like, you know, may pa diva moment no? Uh, a really good area rug that is very, I don't know, maybe of a good... Fluffy. You know, fluffy like a, a four rabbit fur uh, material, or can be just a you know good loomed carpet. Different types of lighting. I think she's the type who likes to have different types of mood lighting. In terms of color palette, ako feeling ko may ato may pagka feminine taupes, a little bit of pink, a blush, maybe a little bit of gray, whites, creams, ganon. Pero nothing dark at all. I feel like she's not ano. She's not my dark person. Or she's not also very, you know, gusto niya maaliwalas na. Medyo soft colors. Soft colors, yeah. oo. Oh, Saka a lot of soft textures for her. Game. Uh, next Sige. na. Game, 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 game. Moss machine. Kachin. Okay. Local ulit. Okay. Local. Nadine Lustre. Ah, And what's ulit. the room? Dining room? Dining. Okay. Mm-hmm. Feeling ko biophilia. And sustainability. Biophilia, biophilia is actually, um, bringing outdoors in um, and using a lot of sustainable materials and a lot of raw materials. So, you know, whether that's through a wooden table or a wooden vase or a nice um, stone top center table, you know. Gusto lang niya very, you know, very neutral, very cool to the eyes, very comfortable, nothing too busy. Also, in her dining space, biophilia pero curved. Like, like it's soft, you know, like maybe curved furniture that's white. The materials are of the center tables are very like raw wood. Yung dining table niya feeling ka very raw wood, you know. Oh, actually, yung iis ko nga dahil raw wood siya na, ano rin, beaded din eh. Oo, like medyo rustic, uh-huh. you know. There is a contrast of the how rustic her table is mm-hmm. to the dining chair. So the dining chair will be a little bit more modern, pero all fabric. She'll have really nice drop lights that maybe can maybe look like, you know, oversized lanterns. Her walls. What are her walls? Ako, ano ba? Feeling ko, either it's painted with large, nice artworks um, or maybe cladded with wood. And then greens. Like, meron marami siyang accent greens all around it. She'll probably have a sizal rug. Yeah, it's green. You know, a sizal rug. 
oh, parang an abakarag to comp to you know to soften up her space. And then curtains niya floor to ceiling would be linens, you know, a curtain that is sort of like breathable. White sheets. And then white sheets. Yeah. I feel like ganun lang siya, very cottony, mabango. Diba? Mabango yung interiors na gusto ni Nadine. So anyway, guys, that wraps up our episode for today. I hope you guys learned a thing or two and I hope it was fun. Comment, suggest. I mean, tumama ba kami? I mean, baka naman sa opinion nyo, we're, hindi kami tumama. So, we'll Just love to find yeah. that out. Comment lang, comment lang. Comment, comment like. subscribe, share, hit the notification bell. <laughs> Lahat, lahat na. Okay. So again, this is Cindy, Mrs. B. This is Mado, Mr. B. And you're watching Mr. and Mrs. B of Boss Design House. Woo! Bye, guys!